hey guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to get this pencil through eye look so the first thing you're going to need is some cotton pads liquid latex fake blood color palette of any choice or a regular makeup palette some foundation some scissors a sponge some brushes I only had one a pencil obviously and let's get to work so right here what I'm doing is just outlining where I want the pencil to go in and come out of this will prevent you from sticking yourself in the eye and eventually injuring yourself and actually having a pencil go through your eye so this is one of the most important steps So in this part of the clip, I am just outlining where I want the actual cotton pad to go. And I just want to say that I made a mistake while filming this. I put liquid latex onto my eye and tried to put the cotton pad there. But the smart thing to do is to apply the liquid latex to the cotton pad and then your eye. And please be super careful with this part because liquid latex can literally burn your eye as close as it gets. And it just smells weird to me so make sure you're really careful during this part so now I'm just applying some foundation to make the entire thing just look really realistic Now onto the fun part, I'm going to be adding some fake blood onto the white parts to just kind of get the white covered. Like what I didn't cover with foundation, I'm just going to cover with a little bit of fake blood. Now I'm going into my color palette and I'm just grabbing just all of the colors that resemble a bruise. So you don't have to actually have a Ben Nye color palette, you can have any makeup palette, anything that you have to resemble something bruised. So you just need the colors purple, black, a little bit of red and between those three colors just keep going back and forth and just blend in and just play with it. This is your time to just have fun and play with it. So now I'm just taking some fresh scab blood by Ben Nye and applying that all over my face. If you don't have that particular blood, you can just use your fake blood and your sponge and it would come out the same exact way. Like it, it really doesn't matter. So I'm just applying that all over and giving it that realistic damaged look. So I'm actually done with 
the look I'm just adding a few more touches and just playing with it a little bit more and that's the completed look guys I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video make sure you like comment subscribe and share and I will see you guys in my next video